All right, boys, so we did get our hands on the free 88 Jalen Waddle you got from watching the MCS streams. Obviously, you had to claim your tokens, and I got mine. I'm excited. Let's check them out, and then let's get some gameplay. Right, so as you guys could see, this is our final Twitch drop bundle right here. There's our last token. We do get a pack, a kickoff pack with it. Imagine an LTD right here. If this was an LTD, that'd be the most insane thing in the world. Nope, it's just gonna be a 76. All right, now let me go show you the set real quick. And there it is, the 88 Jalen Waddle. I already have two of these put in there from the previous day, and obviously the second day is when you got your third token, and boom, there it goes. Now we do get to claim our free 88 Jalen Waddle. This is a card that I, I'm excited for. This is a really, really good free card. There's obviously gonna be a lot of people with him on their team. Let's take a look at his stats right away. 88 overall, the card art looks really good as well for a free card. 5'10", obviously not the tallest in the world. 88 speed, though, on him. He has really good stats across the board. His, his worst stat is 85 deep route running. And then all his catching is 86 plus. He has really good short and medium at 87 and 87. This is a guy, even if you have a god squad, could play your kick returner. 88 change of direction on him. Really good spin and juke move. He has only 72 carrying, but like I said, even like I, you're going to be using this. Like 80% of people are going to be probably using this card. And even if you're in that 20%, you're a god squad. This is a card that could easily play returner even for my team i think he'll get some reps and then probably move to kick returner once we get even better wide receivers in the game but i think we're gonna throw short and elite on him as well i'll show you guys the abilities real quick here are the abilities he gets in his second slot the first slot right here we're gonna be throwing on that short in elite right here the best ability right now on wide receivers and let's get into a game i'm excited Hey boys, so it looks like we are going to be getting the ball first here. And you guys have noticed, I actually really enjoy recording in these house rules. They're actually not that bad this year as they have been in past. As many of you guys know, the stamina has always been a problem. Or it's a stupid mode with X-Factors. It's kind of now just a shorter game where you can record a lot better and get some good clips. But you guys can see Jalen Waddle is our slot right there. Mr. RB on the field. Looks like he is getting pressed to start. And good defense by our opponent. Let's throw that one away. Good D. It looks like we might be getting just stock man the entire game. Not the most fun to go against, but you know, if it works, it works. Let's see if we get Jalen Waddle over here on this corner route now, though. It looks like we could be able to get it off. We are getting absolutely pressed into the dirt. But look at Waddle. He is technically open, but there goes that high top safety. There it goes. Now we have him over here on this left side. Like it, It's it's kind of annoying playing a very passive defense because we're going for big plays here. But let's see. Third and 15. We do need it. It looks like he absolutely smoked them. And Jalen Waddle. There it finally Finally, we're going to smoke him off the edge. He literally killed him right off the press. We'll take a wide open play like that for free. All right, here we go, boys. We need something glitchy right here. We're going to do something like this. We have a lot of routes all over the field. We're looking for that crosser to waddle, of course. And let's see. Looks like B's at. I have to take that. That's way too open to not take. You know what I mean? Way too open. All right, so we did just absolutely destroy his cover four when he first put it on the field. So I'm going to guess he's going to go back to his man coverage and hopefully just hope that they play good defense. That's how a lot of people I swear play this year. But let's see. Jalen Waddle over here on the left side. It looks like we might have a wide open touchdown. He is going to catch the ball with some contact. I have no clue who 21 is right there. But Waddle making it look easy, boys. That was a great dot right there by A-Rod as well. Also, they do change the rules of the house rules every single day. Today, I know the house rules is if you score a touchdown, a passing touchdown, it is 12 points. So we do get a nice little play right there. And I think that's all. Oh, actually, that is our other free card, Julio Jones, that we earned from this house rules. So not a bad start at all from the boys on offense. All right, here we go, boys. Let's see if we can get a stop. We do have a lot of the new cards as well. Troy Paul and Malu right here. I do have, like, Anthony Barr on the team as well. Looks like, oh, I was just a little bit late right there, man. I felt like that was good D. So we have a hurry-up gamer right now. The hurry-up gamers have been absolutely killing me in this house rules lately. Let's see if we can get anything going. And it looks like he's going to... There's Donald Parham right there for you, boys. He has now hurried up three plays in a row. He is absolutely locked into his screen right now. I, I don't know how people get hurried up every single play. And it, oh, he just lobbed the ball. Oh, that could have been a pick. This also, is this a Saints theme team? I can't tell because I know he's running the Saints playable games. Uh, probably not. I see Teron Armstead, Ricky Williams. I don't think it's a Saints theme team. But it looks like, all right, well, that is now his scheme. His scheme. That's two plays now. He just chucked it up to Donald Parham. And that is my least favorite part of this game. I actually really like this game. But that card right there, probably my least favorite thing in the game. Donald Parham. All right, here we go. It looks like, oh, I kind of messed up right there. And he's going to get the two-point convert. That's so disappointing. All right, so now it looks like he is checking into the super meta loop blitz here. Let's see if we can get some success. 
Yeah, there goes the loop right there, boys. Oh, they have now put out two patches to patch that, and it still works. It's disgusting. I actually have no clue how they just can't figure out how to patch it. I have no clue. Uh, and also, the way I used to know how to pick it up doesn't work anymore, so we're kind of just hoping here we do get a stop. Look at Jalen Waddle, though. Absolutely having great success right now. I'm loving this card, boys. He's having a great game. All right, there he is, right out of the loop. I... Like I said, I'm happy he's out of the loop. I had only one good play there, and he's already giving up on it. Let's see if we can get Jalen Waddle here on the sideline to the left, maybe with this crosser. Let's see. And it looks like, actually, he kind of gave up on it. Nice lead right there. We are going to make that guy miss the Stephon Gilmore, man. Boys, I'm, I'm telling you guys, I am loving this card. I'm loving this house rules mode as well. Just giving, you know, good vibes from Jalen Waddle right here. Let's see if we can get a good play over the top. Looks like we're going to have to throw a high ball. Oh, he was open. Come on, man. And that fellow, that would have been amazing. Just two plays in a row right in succession right there. That would have been insane. Let's hit him with a nice little halfback draw here. You know, something to like mix it up a little bit. Also, oh, did we get it? We did not get it. Oh, I had to do that too because Jalen Waddle is about to pass out right now. All right, we need to punch this in. We have all of our backups in there. Our, our whole starting lineup is absolutely gassed right now. And it looks like, uh-oh, boys, a fourth down here. Brutal. I feel like we've been playing so well just for it to come down to a play like this is going to mean everything right here. Let's see if we can get it going. And it looks like, oh, I kind of threw it a little too early. No, there's no way. So, boys, we know exactly what he wants to do. Whenever he's panicking, he just chucks it up to Donald Parham. He just chucks it up to him. Hopefully, Grant Delpit, our six foot three, our tallest player on defense, can have a little bit of success right here. I need me a Ted Hendricks right about now. Let's see. Another great defensive play, boys. We can still win this. All right, second and 22. Let's see what he's going to do. And all right, I understand Donald Parr mossing you, but out beating you in a race, Grant Delpit, there's no way. There's no way. I, I actually can't even make an excuse on how that would have happened. That is actually insane to me. But let's see. Come on. First and 15. We can still get a stop here. It looks like he is not. Oh, this is the exact same play, uh, play he scored that two-point version on. To be honest, it's not really looking good for us here, boys. But it's all right. We're really here for Jalen Waddle. Jalen Waddle's been playing great. We just obviously can't take a three or we did not punch that ball in as well, which absolutely hurt us. But second and five. Come on, boys. All it takes is one play right here. Looks like, oh, and I'm going to get bumped right there, man. That is absolutely killer, and he's going to walk in. We can still clutch up, though. Especially if we get a stop here, we can win the game. We know exactly what he's going to do. He's doing this, and then he's going to have a nice little dump down here. We have guarded that. At, now we know exactly what he's running. So if we score here, get the two-book version, we win the game. All right, so it looks like he is now in that very, very elusive man blitz. Let's see if we can get some protection here to throw it. Looks like Jalen Waddle, exactly when we need him, is going to grab it and get out of bounds. Come on. Oh, man. It's so painful because I just felt like, my, oh, my goal line offense really just kind of choked us for it's there. But let's see if we can get a good play here. Jalen Waddle, he is getting pressed right now. And, oh, that doesn't matter. Look at Jalen Waddle, wide open. Another kind of sus throw right there by Rodgers. I mean, if this doesn't show you that he he's actually playing very well. That's also Stephon Gilmore right there. And he is kind of tired right now. We need we need Jalen Waddle to get wide open right here. Let's see if he can. We need it. Jalen Waddle. And he's going to hold on, baby. I told y'all. We got the clutch, dude. We got the clutch, dude. All it takes is one play. I kind of called a random play right now. I'm not going to lie. I called a random play. I called slants. Everybody's go-to right here. Let's see if we can get anything going. And maybe be in the back. And Julio, come on, man. One stop, boys. No touchdowns allowed. Boys, we're just coming out in a cover four, kind of playing passive here. Attack one bounce is absolutely huge. If we get beat over the top in this, yeah, that's just Madden for you right there. But I, I know Donald Parham is really the one we're kind of looking for here. Let's see. You could have that every single play right now. You do need to get that ball down the field. 32 seconds, and he's not hurrying up. Wow. Oh, hurry up right there, and it just took another 10-plus seconds right now. He's finally going to get that snap off. Let's see. All right, good play, good play. He's getting out of bounds. Okay with that play right there. I'm not going to lie. I am okay with that. I'm actually going to man up Ogba on him. Hopefully, he can have some success right there. Just for that watch of the dump down right there, I think we should be okay. Come on, man. We need a big play, boys. One tackle, one bounce, and we probably win the game. Is the long Yeah, you can't kick a field goal in this mode either. So, it's very... Oh, no. He's chucking it up. And there it is. Stephon Gilmore, baby. I told you. His whole strategy was Donald Parham, and it did not help him in the long run. What's crazy is he's probably going to blitz me to hell right here, isn't he? Because he wants that too. If he gets a safety here, he's literally back in the game. Let's see if Jalen Waddle could have one better play to end the game. And Jalen, oh, it's risky. Oh, he was open. He was open. I actually have no clue why this guy's still in the game. I'm going to be honest. I feel like there's no way I, 
May if I if I were to give up a if I were to give up a nice little safety right here, I'd be probably the worst player in the world. Especially like just staring down Waddle or something. Let's see if we get a good play right here though. Jalen Waddle to end it off to ice it. There it is. Oh, come on, get up. Jalen. Oh man, he had a great. I mean, boys, Jalen Waddle's frying. He was on Gilmore the whole entire game. 87 speed. Gilmore's a really good car in the game right now. And he just made Gilmore look like a rag doll. Hey, boys, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Jalen Waddle absolutely dominating one of the best corners in the game. And Stefan Gilmore, probably a top six or seven kind of got corner in the game. Obviously, they're both free, but it just shows you how good Jalen Waddle could be in any scheme. That was against man cover four, even cover two man. He's had cover three out there as well. And we were dominating in all fashions with him. He's a great card. I hope you guys got your tokens. If you didn't, I have no clue what to say. That is not, I don't work for EA. I have no connection to EA. I cannot help you guys at all. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to smash that like button. And also, it is Mike Vick Day tomorrow. So I hope you guys are ready for that gameplay as well. Have those noties on. And I hope to see you guys then. Peace out, boys.